Hello YouTube viewers, I have made a graphical user interface for digital image processing and I am going, uh, going to show you a demo about it. In this graphical user interface, you can see the four boxes. On the left, the first box will show the live webcam. Second one will show the image captured by pressing the quick snapshot button. And third box will show the result of current operation. And finally, the fourth box will show the histogram of our original captured image. I will call any image in the second box as primary or original image. And image in the third box will be called as transformed image, resulted image, or stencil image. Uh, let's start digital image processing. Press start button to turn on your webcam. When you see live video, okay. when you see the live video, now it's time to take a snapshot. Press take snapshot button, and here, and the uh, image captured by your webcam can display. And this button is clear all. You can play all the images, and you can see your video. Now start the start webcam. By pressing again start webcam button. Press the take snapshot button to capture image. The image has been captured here. Now this is my primary image. And here whatever will appear is called secondary image. Now we can perform. You can see here the name of the image, the location of the image and also a little information like size of the image, format of the image, dimension, motion, height and pixel, and display depth and color type. Now we can perform various operations on this image. The first one is very simple like grayscale turning any RGB image to grayscale. Click on this and here you will get a grayscale image. In the same way you can click the red black and white image can extract red color, blue color information, as well as green color information from this primary image. So you can reset operation any time. Again, now you can perform various edit action, operations like scan with detection, sober light detection, and fluid light detection. This is scan with detection, sober light detection, and sober light detection. Sober light detection, and last one. Again, you can reset your operation. Or if you do not want to, you do not press this button. You can get saturated image, image control image, and then the digital boundary around the object. And, and you can add noise to your this primary image. Press the image click button. And the air zero part will fly the part. And the program will ask which one will appear and which one will ask. As you can see, 0 0.01 is the range, so 0 0.5 and 0 0.2 are the body size. You can change this one by using 0 0.1 and click on the OK and here you will get a noisy image. So you can remove this noise from the image by applying medium filter. Click on the medium filter again. You see that it will use the range of action and ask from the user to enter medium drop action and medium color filter to the trees by the part. Press OK button. That the uh, noise has been done. Okay, you can resize your image. Click on this. It will ask uh, over pixel and by pixel. Let's click OK. You will get this size. And this is the main reset. Now, you can, if you want to take a particular cutout from your picture, click cutout button and you have to select four points. Anywhere on the image, I want to cut off my face here, here, and here, and here, and one and four, four times around your face here. I will get my cut out of the face. Again, the cut out later, you can extract the background from the image. This is background information. 
jumping in the contrast of lighting. By the part, it had asked me to use one dollar value. So, you can see the contrast of the has been changed here. You can put here in the for example, as a value you can select here in the for picture. Again, you can use your equations. You can say how you have all the you know, stop action and all the axis. Uh, now, if you do not have that frame, you can perform all these operations uh, by pressing this load in randomly press this button load image and I am going to select this one so here is my image again the image its location size format all things will be displayed and then you can perform all these operations with the same accuracy uh, you can turn the scale black and white as well components perform camera inspection you can draw the different boundaries and uh, you can make it Time you can create your image by clicking this button, and then any image that is in the boundary will be displayed on your same image. So it's like an arrow that you know that image cancel. Okay, and you can press it again to get it displayed. So uh, you can save your histogram as well. Stop this button and your webcam will be stopped. Again, I am going to start the web. So, uh, if you make things your own UI like this, uh, or you have other ideas, uh, or you want to put some more features, and you feel any difficulty, just press any new button and say, you enter your information. This works only with. Address like this. This then you can enter, and then you have to enter your password and subject and message. So I have to make this uh, uh, window out of this media so that I have uh, I enter my password. I do not want to show this one. So. Password, just click the OK, the OK button. When you press the OK button, you see the name of the email is there. Wait for one minute, and you can see that email has been sent successfully. Uh, I will receive this email at once. Okay, so button and save your UI and then if you want to access it press the edit button. Bye bye and have a nice day.